Hey Chili Heads, welcome back to Red or Green. Today we're going to make one of my favorite recipes to make in the spring. It's light, delicious, we're going to make ceviche. And if you've ever had ceviche at a restaurant, it's basically small bits of fish cooked in citrus and then we add a bunch of ingredients like jalapeno, cilantro, onion. And today I'm going to add something a little bit untraditional. I'm going to add some carrot. And again, it's not a traditional ingredient, but it's very, it's delicious in this and you're really going to like it. Let's talk a little bit about the type of fish to use for ceviche. Today I am using some Dover sole, um, but my favorites to use are tilapia and sole. But you can also use salmon, you can use halibut. There are many different types of fish that you can use for this. This recipe comes together fairly easily. The longest part of this is just letting the fish actually cook in the citrus juice. Let us know in the comments where you like to go and get your ceviche. For me, it's mariscos. I love mariscos here in Albuquerque. If you haven't subscribed, don't forget to subscribe. Share this channel with someone you think would like to learn a little bit about New Mexican cooking. And don't forget to hit post notifications. That way, when, whenever we release a new video, you get notified right away. Let us know also if there are any New Mexican dishes you would like to see on the channel. We'll do our best to get it on the channel in the future. All right, we've got everything we need here, so let's get to it. Let's start by chopping our white fish into a half inch dice. Once you've cut up the entire fish, we're gonna add it to a glass or a stainless steel bowl and top that up with one cup of fresh lime juice. It's important that you use fresh lime juice for this. Now stir it all up, and then we're gonna cover it with saran wrap and put it in the refrigerator for one hour if you want it medium rare, two hours if you want it medium, and four hours if you want it well done. Dice and de-seed two to three jalapenos. Depending on how hot you want it, I'm gonna take out the seeds and some of the ribs because I don't want it to be too hot. We're going to chop up our carrot into a very fine dice. And do the same with one small onion. Next, we're going to dice and de-seed two Roma tomatoes. Two tomatoes is about right for this recipe, but if you'd like to add more or less, it's uh, definitely up to you and your preference. Now we're gonna chop one cup of cilantro. Plenty of cilantro in this recipe is important because it really adds flavor and freshens up the entire dish. Now, after the fish is cooked, according to your preference, we're gonna drain the liquid from the fish. Next, we'll add it to a bowl and add all the veggies and mix to completely combine. We're gonna serve this up with some corn tortilla chips, extra lime, avocado, and maybe a little uh, corona. Enjoy. <laughs> 